You've been up on the blacklist lately? Every listing claims Rishi was the Mark's last known location, including... A bounty on him. Right. Guess someone wants me to go to Rishi. Well... What kind of gal would I be if I disappointed them? Lana Benico. The hunter arrives, just as I'd hoped you would. I trust Rishi has been to your liking. Sandy beaches, shimmering waters, whole bunch of clowns think they're tougher than me. I could get used to it here. And maybe you haven't smelled a Starkless breath yet. Or maybe you have. I don't know. Hello, Farron. We need you to go out there and make life hard for the Revenite's allies, the Nova Blades. If the Revenites are operating out of Rishi, then it stands to reason their leader is here. That's our suspicion too, but we can't say for sure just yet. From what we've been able to gather, the Revenite's agents in the Empire and Republic have been feeding the Nova Blades intel on ship activity. The Blades then use that intel to ambush military patrols and key shipping lanes on both sides. They're essentially remapping hyper routes. We should be taking the fight to the Order of Revan directly. If we knew where on this planet they were situated, we would do just that. We have a trusted source who's determined that the Nova Blades base, a wrecked ship called the Aggressor, contains their entire security apparatus. That's our final target. Revan. Commodore Markok, are you threatening to alter the terms of our deal? I paid you to do a job and you've done it well, but that's over now. I no longer have any use for your Nova Blades. Hey, I know Torch and her Mandalorian clan up and left us, but the Blades still got a lot to offer. Not if you don't have your own house in order. Put an end to the upstart causing you trouble and I'll consider resuming our alliance. really did it. You got them running scared. Margok said something about Mandalorians. Sure hope I'm not going to have to face my own. We don't know much about that yet. Let's take things one step at a time. This is my ship. Think you could just walk on in and be left alive? Getting this. Loud and clear. I'm in. Full access. This is the sort of momentum we could never create on our own. We need to maintain that momentum. Surely, if the Revanites are done with the Nova Blades as Revan indicated, they're onto the next stage of their plan. Revan's hardly the first Force user I've had to take down. It won't be a problem. It's not just Revan here, it's all his co conspirators. We don't know how many in the Republic and Empire are pulling strings for him. While Theron's pulling down data, I suggest you start to make your way back to Raider's Cove. Hopefully you'll have found something of use by then. What have we learned from the aggressor? Very little, I'm afraid. It would appear someone took it upon themselves to corrupt much of the data as a last resort. It's a real mess, getting fragments but nothing incredibly coherent. But one thing that does keep turning up is the Mandalorian Margot brought up earlier, the one they call Torch. What about her? Well, it looks like Torch and Margog were thick as thieves for a while, then something happened. Had to do with the Revanites. Don't really know the details, but it looks like Torch moved her whole clan to another island here on Rishi. I've got the coordinates. There has to be something better to go on than an island of Mandalorians with vague motives. It's the best we have for now, so it will have to do. If I find anything else, we'll have Jakara look into it. I'm sending Jakara out on a scouting run. I've made local arrangements for your transportation should he not return in time. Well, you've been busier than I thought. 
Get whatever information you can from the Mandalorians. With any luck, they'll lead us to the Revenite. Power restored. Systems online. Hello? Hello? Are you the Grand Champion? Who is this? I'm Sarah Markin. Krista's daughter. She was your handler, right? On the Great Hunt? I heard you were on Rishi. I want to meet with you. Krista's dead. Krista never mentioned you. And a lot of people have this frequency. A lot of people don't like me. This isn't a trap. I know you'd shoot me. That's what you do. Look, without Krista, you'd still be on Droman Koss. Without Krista, you wouldn't have a ship. You may work for Sid now, but you didn't always. Besides, I'm not asking a favor. I'm offering a job. Name a time and place. I'll be there. I've got a room in the cantina. I'll be drinking. Bring your slicer if you want to check my story. Just come soon as you can. Thanks for doing this. Krista was crazy, but I kind of liked her. If something's happened. Sarah Markon? Stars, you're like a walking... Does anything you're wearing not kill people? You said Krista was dead? My mom. Yeah. She talked about both of you. She hunted for years, wanted me to take up the business, but coaching you was her biggest win. She got a rep for it. You made her respect it again. She liked that. Krista didn't talk much about her life. She wanted you to be a bounty hunter? When I was a kid, she'd leave me at home while she was out chasing marks. She'd come back smiling and bruised. I don't like bruising. She was disappointed, but we stayed in touch. So what happened? I run a small shipping concern. Direct to customer regulated goods. Smuggling. Right. Krista got killed protecting my business from the Canowin Syndicate. Thugs dealing in weapons and spies. Canowins have been after me for months. They want my roots, my customers. Krista's rep, your rep, I made them keep their distance. What sort of chatter is there about this syndicate? I know it's pretty small. Just a few dozen men, but with serious credentials. They skinned an exchange boss who wouldn't join. A few weeks back, they started harassing me again. Krista showed up. I might have mentioned your name, too. The Canowins said they wouldn't fall for it this time. They said Mom was washed up. They said you're Imperial now. You don't do underworld jobs. They didn't say that. That's not okay. Everyone says it. That you escaped the life to become, I don't know, dark council enforcers. They killed Mom, but I still have money. I'm putting a bounty on the Canowins. I want their bosses in a bloody heap. I owe Krista Markon, and I pay my debts. Forget the credits. Okay. Thank you. Finding the Canowins won't be hard. Start at the bottom, work your way to the leaders. Avax, Crone, and Dastid. Avax used to be an assassin for the Shevin conglomerate. Brutal, kind of a sadist. Crone's her brother, former slaver, loves his guns. And Dastid? Worked for the cartel until McKeb happened. Hit a colony ship once, spaced 500 people on board. Watch out for him. I'll hit those three after the rank and file. Where do I look? I've got a list of their hangouts. I'll stay in touch over comm if you want. I want you to know, I appreciate this. Krista would too. You're dead meat! I can think of the point. Where do I find the leaders? They all own property nearby. I'd say go and knock. Tell him Krista says hi. Be careful, though. These guys are violent, but they're not stupid. The Krista's alert. I'm not scared of you.
about Krista Argon. You are. Just like the rest of us, you'll still die today. Sarah, the job is done. I'll be back soon. You did it. You're sure you did it? Dested wears armor. Trust us, armor melts. The Canawin Syndicate is finished. Its leaders are dead. Thank you. Really, thank you. I don't... I don't like having people killed. But we had to. Not just for the business, but for my mom. She'd be glad it was you. Krista went down fighting for the sake of her family. That's not a lot of comfort, but it should mean something. No, I know. I get it. You said you wouldn't charge, but Krista would never accept charity. I've transferred a little to your accounts. Can I ask you something, though? I know you're not, like, a citizen, but you must have opinions about working in the Empire. You don't last as a bounty hunter by judging your clients. I stick by that. Mostly. It's complicated, but if we weren't doing the work, someone else would. And at least we're professionals. Of course. I'm not questioning your decisions. So, just a thought? You must be big enough to have some authority there. Priority access, clearance codes, that sort of thing. What are you suggesting? Now that my business is safe, I want to expand. You could get me access to Droman Koss. I could sell contraband to a whole new market. We'd both profit. No spice, no slaves. Otherwise, we have a deal. You're asking me to work with one hand tied behind my back. If you don't like it, you can walk away. No, I can... I can make it work. If we have to betray our client's trust, I suppose it could be worse. Some people might say you were getting soft, if they knew. But they won't. Thank you again. For Krista. Not just the business. Come on, Mako. We've got jobs waiting. <laughs> Approaching Torches Island. Warning. Enemies detected. you're doing in our compound but since you're here let's see what you're made of Oh, my God. 
was almost up to Mando's standards. pretty well for yourselves but you're in the arena now meet joss and volk husband and wife tough as durasteel undefeated and still eager to prove themselves Time we met. All functioning systems nominal.
shave this that little nickname the locals came up with. Hell if I know why. He recently had a falling out with the Revenites and the Nova Blades. One Mandalorian to another. Think you could help me out? What? You think I didn't recognize Mandalore's favorite champion? I might be off the grid these days, but I'm not thick. Tell you what, instead of whatever grand gesture of cooperation you thought might happen here, why don't we try something a little different? It's been a while since I had a decent challenge. I'm taking this opportunity to show my clan how it's done. Dear than I'd like to admit. Just a little. Felt good to be in a real scrap for once. I'm impressed. Flattery, huh? Well, what the hell, I'll take it. So, you know the Blades went and partnered up with the Revenites. Means you probably know they're up to no good. We helped out the Blades to have a good relationship with Raiders Cove. We didn't sign up for the Revenites in their all out war, so we bailed. All right. Get your clan together and let's take it to the Revenites. The Empire will pay whatever you want. We're pretty well set here, thanks. Whole reason we came to Rishi was to avoid this stuff. Give me a single target that's worth my going toe-to-toe -to -toe with. That's fine. But the Revenites and their fleet of warships? Pass. Where are these ships? Couldn't tell you. I wouldn't mind it a bit if you chased the Revenites out of Rishi. Off the radar is just how we like it here. My tour shimmy, Mando. It was an honor to spar with you. Jesus Bandoade! Who's up for a Skarkla hunt? What's going on? Theron's been captured by the Revenites. Data from the Nova Blades hinted at the location of a Revenite safe house in Raider's Cove. We looked into it and were ambushed. They wouldn't bother taking Theron prisoner unless they needed something from him. Were I in their position, I'd do everything I could to learn how much Theron knows. Whatever the case, I stand by my decision to not impede in Theron's abduction. And I know Theron would too. 
Now he's in a position to do what he does. Theron should never have fallen into enemy hands. He can't let it stand. I wouldn't dream of leaving him with the Rephanites. After all, we need to know what his land was in captivity. Hopefully you've fared better with the Mandalorians. Revan has a fleet of warships on standby. Of course. From examining the Nova Blades data, it looks as though they've been routing Imperial and Republic fleets here to Rishi. So the Empire and Republic are drawn into a full-scale battle, and whoever's left standing, the Revanites pick off. And we still don't know who we can trust. We need to interfere with the Revanites' plans, if not stop them outright. Uh, uh, uh. Yes, it's true. I was able to pinpoint several communications originating from another island. I'm told there's a Rishi village on the outskirts. I can't imagine they would resent our presence there. All right, let's not waste any more time. We'll set up shop there, and I'll see if Revan prefers carbonite or cinders. Very well, Hunter. We have to assume Revan's expecting a resistance force now. You should expect to find patrols along the way. <laughs> 